gave the order to launch rockets at northern Israel? Residents of the town of Kiryat Shmona in the north of Israel were rocked on Wednesday morning by loud explosions and then by two large fires. The explosions were caused by two rockets, believed to have been fired from Lebanon and which exploded near a residential area. No one was injured by the rockets, but hundreds of Israelis had to be treated for shock. A third rocket failed to reach Israel and exploded in southern Lebanon. The Israel Defense Forces, IDF, responded with three artillery barrages directed at the sites in southern Lebanon from which the missiles were launched. Then early in the morning of Thursday, the Israel Air Force, IAF, came into action, bombing sites in southern Lebanon for the first time since the Second Lebanon War in 2006. Lebanese President Michael Aoun, a lackey of the regime in Iran, even had the chutzpah to accuse Israel of aggression after the Israeli response. Israeli media reported that Palestinian terror groups in Lebanon were likely responsible for the rocket attack, as these groups have already carried out the same type of attack twice in the past few months. It could be, but there seems to be no immediate reason for these Palestinian groups to carry out a risky rocket attack on Israel. The other rocket attacks on northern Israel by Palestinian groups were related to Israel's conflict with Hamas and tensions around the Temple Mount in Jerusalem. It's now relatively quiet there, and the same applies to the situation in the south of Israel, where Hamas regularly threatens to resume its rocket attacks on the Jewish state, but has not carried out this threat so far.